I'm Joyce DiDonato, and as part of our engagement initiative that accompanies my latest album, Eden, I'm here at Bishop Ramsey Church of England School to help young people reconnect with nature through the power of music. Bishop Ramsey Choir! Bishop Ramsey School for the initial pilot workshop for Eden. You guys, thanks for being here today. I'm Joyce. What I've asked the kids here to do is to think about nature, to think about what if trees could sing. And then they were invited to write a song with that question in mind, to show them that they can actually use their voice to connect to the world around them. These are the bulbs that you planted, yeah? yeah. How many, do you know how many you planted? 18. <gasps> what else are you doing in the Eco Club? I'm gonna show you. One of the things that touched me so much about this project is that they have an incredible woodland around their school. Okay, well these trees are more your size than mine. <laughs> <laughs> they're starting to see that there are foxes, there are trees, there are birds, and they're falling in love with it. That's the tree. <gasps> wow. Yeah, there's still life going on it. I'm sure there's all kinds of beetles and ants in here. This is part of the ecosystem, right? So when you came into this area, right, we gave you the question, what if trees could sing? What was your first thought? The lyric I got was like, why should I die? Because it's quite unfair how trees are getting cut down for no reason. I kind of think of all the generations that each tree has seen. I kind of noticed how beautiful everything is. Because before when we had our lessons here, we kind of never really focused on it. But then through Eden, we've kind of looked at it and uh, we've thought, Oh, well, this is so amazing. We have to work harder to try and save it. That's so beautiful. The fact that you guys have spent some time here, you've started to sing about it, to write about it, to experience it, this starts to feel like part of your home too. The other thing that we're going to find now is working together as a choir is we have to work together as one unit, like a forest. There's a lot of individual trees and individual voices, but now we get to go and work together as a forest. Let's lead the way. Can I sit here? So the journey of putting our choir together and preparing all this music is a really intensive, lengthy one. And their amazing teacher, Mike Roberts, collected lyrics, collected melodies, and put together this song, Seeds of Hope. That's amazing. Fantastic. Well done. Okay. So putting together Seeds of Hope as a song, the big question we asked was, uh, what if trees could sing? All the children came back with some lyrics and some little fragments of music. So what you hear in the song um, is all from the children. Uh, I, I've just really pieced together the jigsaw of their, of their creativity. You can see them over my shoulder, I think, just having a huge amount of fun um, because they're getting to express and getting to create. And, uh, you know, there's a real link between, between joy and creating. There's such a beautiful dance between the classical music world and the natural world. For the kids, once we kind of just take them by the hand, show them what the human voice can do, that inherently demonstrates how powerful human beings are, right? Look what the voice can do, what it can convey. They have that same voice inside of them as well. Anybody want to perform some of their song? Why, why should I die? I'm loving hearing them sing. It's, it's, this is my world. This is where I fell in love with music, at their age, singing in choir. Deforestation. It was so interesting. You see all different levels of security, and, and yet they're here, and they're showing up, and they're making music. And I think if they stay with the music, it will just continue to empower them, empower them, and build their confidence. It's very rare that I'm in the presence of so many composers that are still alive, let alone so young. <laughs> do you guys feel like we can do this anthem? Yeah. Fresh Seeds of Hope? Yeah. Let's do it. Yeah. This has sort of exceeded my expectations. And it really is the exact example of planting a seed and having it blossom into something huge. This is the song that the choirs are gonna be singing around the world. They're gonna be singing the song that was born here. 
I'm just so proud of the students. The song has been created by them in partnership with one another. And the words, uh, the fact they've come from my children, I get terribly emotional when I hear it. Really emotional, sorry. about empowering them through this music that is uplifting and peaceful and harmonious. All the things that we want to try and rebuild back in our world. That's what Eden is trying to inspire.